Romantic movies are completely unrealistic. They portray love as this thing that just happens. Like it's all consuming. I mean, I'm sure it is for some, but to set up the idea of love as something that has to be that way is not good. Exactly. And the majority of people who watch romance movies are teenage girls. And it sets girls up to think that guys are always going to do these romantic gestures, like write you a letter every day Why for a year. Why you write me? Why? It wasn't over for me. I waited for you for seven years. And now it's too late. I wrote you 365 letters. I wrote you every day for a year. You wrote me? Yes. It wasn't over. It still isn't over. I mean, I'm sure some guys would do that, but there are far more women who expect that type of guy than there are men willing to do it. Right? I mean, I was looking it up the other day, and the vow alone made $125 million in theaters. And I mean, the movie is completely unrealistic. What are the odds that a woman is going to get in a car accident, survive, but have no memory, and then be lucky enough to have a husband as hot as Channing Tatum who's willing to fall in love all over again? I mean, that only happened once. Hell, what are the but, odds that someone's going to have a husband as hot as Channing Tatum anyways? And I mean, I've been watching romantic movies my whole life, and now I can't have a healthy relationship because I don't feel the way that people portray, people are portrayed in the movies to feel. I feel like I'm the defective one. I mean, I want somebody to be as hot as Channing Tatum and have the personality of Johnny Castle and Dirty Dancing, and I want us to have the chemistry of Noah and Allie. But then I know that even deep down that if I had that relationship, I wouldn't find it attractive at all. Like, I'd find it creepy. <laughs> One more time. Okay. Hold my head, go. Two weeks together. That's all it took. Two weeks for me to fall in love with you. Hi, I'm Michelle. I'm Sarah. Your eyes are perfect. Oh, but your hair is so beautiful. I think I love you. I think I love you too. Um. You're a terrible singer. I know. Girls, please stop thinking that your relationships are on TV or real. There are actors who are paid a disgusting amount of money who are paid to act like they are in love with each other. Very rarely does it come out to be real love. If you keep thinking that you're Rachel McAdams waiting on Ryan Gosling to fall in love with you, I have some bad news for you. You're wrong. Does this look romantic to you? Does this look fun? Because it's not. 